What's good? I'm Brian Tong and welcome to the Apple Bits for everything good and bad inside the world of Apple. And can I just say this is cray cray. Like I can confidently say in the entire history of Apple, we have never seen leaks this bad. Like I'm floored by this, but hey, here it is. All right. The official iPhone 10s has leaked out alongside of the Apple Watch Series 4 thanks to 9 to 5 Mac and you can see them here in all their glory. And these aren't some sketchy photos coming out of a Chinese factory, no. 9 to 5 Mac makes it clear these are not mock-ups implying these are images coming directly from inside Apple and we might see them in future marketing material. Now they dropped the first bomb that both the 5.8 inch and 6.5 inch OLED iPhones will officially be called the iPhone XS. But you know, I like to call it the tens or the iPhone tennis. That's right. I'm sticking with that. Ow! Ooh, you can't unsee that. No. Now the new iPhone XS will come in a new gold color option that's shown in the picture. And honestly, it looks like a little deeper, richer, all gold, everything. I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty sick. And again, according to 9 to 5 Mac, this is a picture directly from their sources with the implication that this image originates from Apple HQ. And then on top of that, not only is the Apple Watch expected to be unveiled, but 9 to 5 Mac dropped another bomb revealing the first look ever of the Apple Watch Series 4 in another leak. Now, you know, I'm super excited about the Apple Watch Series 4 and there are plenty of things we can pull from this image, which doesn't really showcase the new display that is rumored to increase 15% in size and go edge to edge. Now, first up, a new jam-packed watch face with eight freaking complications. Like, look at all of those things. And you can bet there are other new ones. I actually like the fact there's a ton of information on the watch face, but the first thing I see that stands out is in the bottom left corner where it says UVI. That stands for ultraviolet index, which is a measurement of the amount of ultraviolet rays and a color meter that matches up to the UV index scale. So let's just say anything in the very high to extreme zone, which is red to purple, will have you looking like Sarah Connor in Terminator 2. But it would also tell me that the new Apple Watch could potentially have some sort of UV sensor in it because it would be completely inaccurate if you were in the shade or a building that was pulling data from the internet generically. Now, the physical details that stand out, the huge red dot on the digital crown is gone. Thank you very much. I mean, it was way too big and instead they have made this subtle ridge around the top of the digital crown. There's a new hole between the digital crown and the side button, which is presumably a new placement for a microphone for better sound. And it also looks like all the Apple Watch bands will still work with this year's models based on this leaked image. Thank you again. Now, 9 to 5 Mac makes it clear, like this assumption is that the image came directly from Apple again. This is really unheard of, you know, already to know this much right before a keynote for Apple. I mean, this is the company who even had internal presentations given to Apple employees to prevent leaks, which also leaked out to the public. You know, I'm just blown away by it. And as crazy as all this was, the big story was supposed to be that Apple officially confirmed September 12th for their iPhone Apple Watch keynote event, but that's already old news if you're using it for your headline. So here's the invite, take a look, it says, gather round, but honestly, there's no need to read into that when we have major leaks that completely trump the invite. Now, there still will be other tidbits and nuggets that we don't know, and I'm always excited about a tech keynote, but again, I'm still shook. Like, we just haven't seen leaks anywhere on this level ever before an Apple keynote. So, what do you think about all this? Maybe these leaks are fake because Apple would never let that happen. Oh, bless your heart, there, there's always one of you out there. But are you more excited? Are you less excited? You might not even care, but let me know in the comments because the iPhone XS and the Apple Watch Series 4 have just been leaked. Now, if you're digging this video, you know the drill. Thumbs up, subs up, and hit that notification bell. Oh, so I can make a vibration on your inner thigh when my next video drops. All right, thanks for watching. I'm Brian Tong, and we'll catch you all next time for all the bits and bites inside the world of Apple. Take care, be safe, peace.